Chapa G, Cha Cha Chapa G roll call. My name is Mia. I am a Spartan. I don't do drugs, so check me out. Cha Cha Fuji, Cha Cha Chapa G roll call. My name is Brad. Yeah. I am a Spartan. Yeah. These pants are small. Yeah. So check me out. So, so check, check us out. out. You have split ends, but it, it, it's okay. It's okay, you're a good friend. <laughs> oh, Mr. Hudson! Hey, it's your dad! Hey, Mr. Hudson! Hey! No, Dad! We can't take a picture right now! The flash will distract the players! Mia, my dad wants to take a picture uh, of us. You just told me I had split ends, Brad! I'm sorry. Oh my god! <laughs> hey, who's that team we're playing this weekend? The, the Indians! Oh my god, I had a chance! Okay, okay. Let's, go, let's go! Who's that spawn in my TP? It's me! It's me! Who's that spawn in my TP? It's me. It's me. Native American! Yeah! Yeah! Let's go, Spartan! Let's go, Spartan! Yeah! Woo! Good morning, West Hall. I'm Mia McKenzie. And I'm Brad Hodgson. Today is Wednesday, October 8, 2014, and this is your West Side News. Attention all students. The PSAT will be given to current sophomores on Wednesday, October 15. The test is important because it's a national merit qualifying test. There's no charge to take it as a sophomore. Freshmen and juniors are also encouraged to take the test. However, there is a fee of $14 for those who are not sophomores. If you are a freshman or a junior and would like to take the PSAT as a precursor to a SAT, and or to find out your AP potential, please bring $14 to the administration office to sign up. Any junior or senior interested in a technical career option? We will be taking 55 students on October 15th from 9.30 a.m. till 11.30 a.m. to tour the Lanier Technical College campus. You must be passing all classes in order to go. Please sign up in the guidance office today. Attention all seniors, early action deadlines are coming up. The early action deadline for UGA and Georgia Tech is next Wednesday, October 15th. The early action deadline for UNG, Delano campus only, is November 15th. Seniors, get your applications submitted. FBLA and DECA are starting a canned food drive. These two clubs are participating in the Salvation Army food drive. Listen up students, every 10 cams you bring in as a donation will enter you for a chance to win an iPad. There will be other prizes from the school store and Spartan print shop. So bring in some cans. Do you like fairy tales? Come see your favorite fairy tales with a bit of a twist in Into the Woods. This Thursday, October 9th and Saturday, October 11th at 7 p.m. $5 for students and $7 for adults. I'm here with Ariel Gravely and Allie Compton and they are in the production Into the Woods. Um, Ariel, why should people come see the show? People should come see Into the Woods because it's going to be an amazing show, it's funny, and people should just come support their Spartan players. Alright, cool. And Allie, what is the show about? Uh, Into the Woods is basically a musical about a combination of fairy tales and each character has a journey and they want to get their wish. Cool. So, come to the show. It's Thursday and Saturday, $7 for adults, $5 for students at 7 o'clock. Attention all students, make sure you guys go and follow the West Hall Yearbook Instagram page and tag us in any pictures you think are good to put in the yearbook. They will be having a contest each week and will be announced on the winner each Friday. <laughs> Attention all students, make sure you guys go and follow the West Hall Yearbook Instagram page and tag us in any pictures you think are good to be put in the yearbook. They will be having a contest each week and will be announcing the winner each Friday. So make sure you tag the yearbook Instagram in all your pictures. Attention all seniors, believe it or not, graduation is just around the corner. Please visit the following site soon to let Mr. Phillips know what name you want to have printed on your diploma. The site is tinyurl.com backslash WHHS diploma. You can find this link on the senior website at westhallseniors.weebly.com as well as the Westside News website, thewestsidenews.weebly.com. This weekend, October 10th, 11th, and 12th, we will have about 2,000 Special Olympic athletes in Hall County participating in bocce, softball, cycling, and golf. These events will take place at North Hall Park, Laurel Park, and the Chicopee Woods Golf Course. We are needing additional volunteers for the weekend. Our Hall County delegation will have 96 athletes competing in bocce and golf. 
This would be a great opportunity for IB, Beta, National Honor Society, FCA, and other school clubs to acquire community service hours. If you can come and help out one or all three days, please email Stephen Sparks with Special Olympics Georgia at stephen.sparks at specialolympicsga.org. The Sparks email will be on the Westside News website for your convenience. Today in Spartan Sports, there will be swim team conditioning today and the remainder of the week starting at 4 on the track. Our cross country team will be competing today at the Hall County Championships at Riverside Military Academy. They will begin at 4. There will be a mandatory wrestling meeting tomorrow in the theater. Anyone interested in wrestling should be at this meeting. Conditioning starts October 14th. You must have a physical before then. See Coach Raddick for details. Check your ID, Spartans. These are now a part of dress code, so make sure you have it on at all times when you're in the building. You get the first one free, but if you have to replace it, it will cost you $7 in the media center. So make sure you don't lose it. That's all for today's announcements, so please stand for the moment of silence and continue standing for the Pledge of Allegiance. <laughs>